I like being Hmong because we we know how to survive. Also, the Hmong people that live in Laos go through a lot of wars. Wars are the worst things that could happen because a lot of people, Hmong people, goes die through the war. I feel sad for the Hmong people that fought for their family and their culture or religion. I'm so honored for the people that fought for our freedom and safety. I feel special because there are a lot of Hmong people that are like me. I wonder why Hmong people that in Vietnam were captured by Hmong, by people that lived in China. My name's Alexa and I'm wearing Hmong girl clothes. Hi, my name is Yuan. I wear an Hmong um, boy clothes. My name is Sophia. I'm wearing green clothes and I'm Hmong. Hi, my name is Kingu and I'm wearing some Hmong clothes and I kind of like the pants and the sash. It's kind of pretty to me. Hi, my name is King Lu and I'm going to show you this new house and the things inside it. Hi, my name is Sophia Yang. I'm going to help her. Hi, my name is Angelina and I'm going to help her. This is called, this is kind of like the attic where they put their special stuff, like things they use to take care of their farm, their plates and stuffies. And in Hmong, they call it Lung Ta. And I think some things are so interesting are up here. Oh, I can't reach it because I'm still short. This is the oven, and this is where they like cook rice or food that they need to eat. They mostly eat um, meat and that are from that are from the forest, like a squirrel, a deer, or any kind of animals in the forest. You guys actually get animals from the woods or everything around it. Hi, um, this is what Hmong people used to cook. <coughs> and they call it Lu Loko. This is a broom. It's pretty much like my broom at home. It's just like, it, ha it has a little moon design on it, moon colors. And, oh, oh, and it also has... Today I'm going to show you guys that this is how you guys make rice in here. They use this to take, to like, separate the dirt from the rice and the thing. They use the This is called the go. And they use it to put their veggies and rice in here. And to do that, they use a little tool, I mean a big tool. And also another tool, and I kind of forgot what they're called. This is kind of like like you hold the grain and then you just pull it. So it's much easier than, than a knife. So they use this instead of the knife. 